Hello, Internet. I am Mike Kaplan, a person who funded a Kickstarter recently uh, where I was aiming to raise at least one dollar to find out what conceptual art is in a conceptual art project to send Kickstarter itself a physical envelope with a stamp, uh, and that's what would cost the dollar, with a letter in it asking what's conceptual art. Uh, I succeeded beyond my wildest dreams. I raised about $400, and uh, what do I do with the rest of that money? Uh, there's a lot of questions about accountability for people who raise more than their funds that they wanted on Kickstarter. Uh, so it's a great question. I am certainly going to do what I said. I'm going to send the letter. All the people who ask for their rewards will get their rewards, be a part of the letter in whatever way they said. Uh, the guidelines would be. And additionally, uh, I don't know if you're technically not allowed to donate to charity with money that you raise on Kickstarter. You're not allowed to start a Kickstarter specifically to donate money to charity, just in case I'm not going to use the money that I raised to donate to charity, but I am donating a similar amount on my own to uh, anti-malaria. That's, uh, that's the charity that I've gone with. I believe it's called Against Malaria. Let's put the uh, website here. And uh, I, I found that through a, a site called givewell.org. That's here. Eh? It's fun, technology. Here. I didn't even say anything. Great, that was just a joke. You guys get jokes, or, or you don't, and it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be one. It was a poem, if you want. Either way, it doesn't matter. Uh, I found that website from a, a book by Peter Singer called The Life You Can Save. Here? Uh, it's a book I really recommend about uh, how people who have more than enough money should, uh, or can, certainly can, there's no necessarily should, but maybe should, uh, use that money to do things to help people who have less than enough, uh, like people, kids all around the world dying of malaria, which is easy to stop. Uh, so I have $400 worth stopped that. Uh, and then the money that I've raised, so I got, I brought in some money, I'm going to use it to do what I said, and then also I have it, and I've also put out some other money. So... I think uh, accountability as delivered as possible. And uh, in case you were curious, here is the letter that I wrote. Uh, from the desk of Mike Kaplan, comedian, human, Kickstarter user, uh, September 2012. Dear Kickstarter, I recently funded a conceptual art project on your website called What is Conceptual Art? A Conceptual Art Project. In it, I aim to raise a dollar in order to purchase a stamp and an envelope in which to put a letter that I promised to send to you, Kickstarter, in order to inquire as to your definition of conceptual art as conceptual art. And this is that letter. So, what does conceptual art mean to you? If someone says something it is conceptual art, like I did, does that make it so? I said it was, and you accepted it. Is that all it takes? Or is there something more at work here? Is there anything I could have submitted under the category of conceptual art that would not have been accepted? If you have a moment, I and my project's 162 backers would love to hear your thoughts on the matter. Please email them to MikeKaplan at gmail.com or send them to the following address. Then I give my P.O. box, uh, which I'm not going to give to you. I mean, if you wanted to send me nice things, that would be fine. Uh, but, you know, just email me. And if, you, if you're like, hey, I want to send you a nice thing. I'll send you via email the P.O. box. Just, you know, another level uh, of really caring about it to get through it. So thanks for your time, your consideration, and your website. We eagerly, eagerly, I can't get that one right. It, we're eagles here. We're trying to, I'm trying to be an eagle eye about this. So if, if there's eagles involved, then they definitely eagerly await the response. Everyone else eagerly awaits it. Sincerely, Mike Kaplan, as well as the following pages of backers. Uh, and I'm not reading all the names of the 162 people because that wasn't part of the deal. Uh, if you want your name read in a video by me, I guess email me or eagle me. You know, send an eagle and tell me to do it, and maybe I will. If you definitely, if you train an eagle with a, that comes with an uh, like a carrier eagle, not just a pigeon. Man, if you hire an eagle to don't have him murder a carrier pigeon, just get his job. Like I'm an eagle, I could do it better. I have the the eyesight. You know what's the the pigeon? I mean the pigeon's like we don't. What else we we don't do anything else? We could we'll let us carry stuff. You carry disease. Get out of here. We hate you, eagle. That's where it's at, America. So if you send an eagle with a note that says to do whatever the last thing. Oh yeah, I release the names. I'll do it. In any event, until then. Thank you very much for watching, listening, being interested, participating, whatever it is that you're doing. Uh, this is a long internet video. Thanks. I'm Mike Kaplan.